just spotted my enemy looking dead at me No one else is you and me, the art of war Try to bring in infantry, I suggest retreat Cause there's never peace deep in the art of war Yo, what the fuck is really good? It's your boy Yellow Mess, chilling out here. We out here at the beautiful motherfucking Lucid Gallery. This is the second annual edition of our Miami Mayhem event. And reporting live for the 305, this is the art of war, Miami, where the fuck you at? Yeah. <laughs> My nigga, this is years in the making. You already know what the fuck time it is. It's time for a motherfucking title match. Let's get it! If you're a motherfucking real fan of Day County Battle Rap, I don't even really have to introduce these two motherfuckers. You've already been watching them take motherfucking heads off in this motherfucking title tournament. But the Mortal Kombat title tournament is real, the title belt is real. And on my left, to your right, repping Art of War, making his motherfucking stake for the claim for this title belt. Make some noise for him to rock! Tournament. If you don't know who this man is, you ain't been following the motherfucking art of war. You need to change that right now. On my right, to your left, make some noise for Dex One! <laughs> Time Limit King has arrived. <laughs> Alright. Yeah. With me, the beautiful, from King of the Dot, from Toronto, my soon to be wife. Make some noise for Miss Steve. My judges, Blake the motherfucking barbarian. New York, yeah. living in the South, smoking like I'm out west, moving like I got wheels. You heard? <laughs> Holding it down, one crazy ass motherfucking poet, and also representing on behalf of the Angry Fan Movement. Shout out to my boy, real proper, like. Uh, Cats, see you, Angry Fan Movement. The fuck is really good. And this one guy I smoked pop with him one time, man, it was really fucking cool. Give it up for my boy, Johnny Hopkins. <laughs> I smoke pot with Johnny Hopkins. <laughs> I smoke pot with him one time. It was pretty cool. The the owner of the dads. Go I, I I I smoke with him and then I'm, I'm here. I, that's that's all yeah, I remember. Just... Anyways, we're getting ready. Y'all ready for this motherfucking title match? You're about to say yeah. Let's go! On May 2nd, there was a fight between two legends. <laughs> Unite history will repeat itself on May 22nd, as once again there will be a deciding factor between two veterans. But let's start this off with a question. Can any of you battle rap fools last longer in a fight than 30 seconds? <laughs> <laughs> Come on, man. The more pain you feel should be able to give you more aggression. I ain't never been knocked out. And I've been jumped by people using golf clubs as weapons. And they and they have way more fucked up intentions. <laughs> First you filmed yourself beating up Thousand, then you filmed yourself when Cash Kai beat you. What a perfect case of karma for Mr. Hindu. <laughs> but the funny thing is, nobody gets to fly and fuck what you've been through. Not even if you would have sat on Web3 still though. Not even if you would have... <laughs> And that goes for me too, Hindu rock. Your girl Lori told me you got a little cut. You will not be the spot. You will get got. Fuck it with Dex, man. This nigga must have gotten hit harder than I thought. Yo, y'all seen 
a fight on YouTube, right? You get the <laughs> phrase, don't trust the shirt on your back, a whole new meaning. Yes, you know. How are you the spokesperson for our board, but you were grown full bleeding, in a fickle position on the floor, getting kicked in the ceiling? You went from street wars to our board to literally crawling on the streets. What did you think, man? Go, oh, wait, look on the floor. I think there's a piece. Ooh. Well, you swear that Cass Kai was his producer the way that he was giving him the beats. <laughs> How on that approximate day, everything that you told Cash went the exact opposite way. What was it? Opposite day? <laughs> but neither, no, but neither of you got a whole lot of brains. You see, anger causes a disturbance in the psyche which manifests itself in the ego. These disturbances cause your heart rate to increase and your body temperature to rise, turning you into stupid people. This is the art of war, a classic example of good versus evil, leaving these prepaid judges to decide who's more lethal, repudiating my articulate dialogue with so much truth and see-through. You ain't got no juice, Beetle, and you could've sold your way out of the situation with the loose needle. Fuck you, you two primos. Torture. You get your feet froze while eating an insane amount of Fritos Tied up in a chair under a rib while I practice free throws <laughs> What? I like basketball All my battles are classical I'm a savage animal dislocating your clavicle with rhymes that are flammable Because my shit's hotter than Tam Miami Tamales Let's be honest Let's be honest They both may have scammed a lot of the same chicks but they all swallowed my salami <laughs> Buying them Kalimari. You ain't the Dalai Lama, you be taking Mali's and La Cama. I'm Tex One, and see my vuelta de la semana. Just throwing the bitches in La Playa, reducing MCs to plasma. You ain't up like me in the plaza. Plus, you work at macaroni grill and you don't appreciate pasta. <laughs> That's a double plus for me. At a double pulse, you bleed. I suck volts out of electricity and stick it into me. This isn't about the humility, it's about the purity. And indubitably, Miami wants to see this rude Cuban dude speak. So move over, Javi. You couldn't make people move out of their seats. I heard your music, eh, you don't quite do it for me. I guess so. Take a bunch of drugs and aspirins, wake up and fuck up an assassin. And I do it in such fashion, it's like I rushed you while you were blasted. You get stuck like magnets. I breathe the lust of a dragon. Don't ever trust your parents, because they'll leave you alone in a world that sucks and it's nothing but an entrapment. How'd I get stuck with Aladdin? I'll rip out your guts and abdomen. You got your camera crew, buddy? Because once again, you're filming yourself losing blood and battling. I mean what I say, and I put don't put shit in disguise. I'm saying this to the bitch. This bitch keeps buried inside. I do things in a day where you would think it's too scary to try, but I'd rather die on my feet than to be buried alive. So don't get too close to me, homie. I'll slap you. I've been all over the world battling. You couldn't even go to Atlanta. Never traveled, cause every other night he getting thrown in the slammer. Or he's being mistaken as a fat Cuban on stage at Diaz Brothers Merc instead of Tony Montana. So you wanna post some hip hop history? Well here's a couple facts for you. Dex started rapping back in 92. <laughs> and he was like 32. <laughs> this fool really think he gotta live forever. Your mom came to my job. She said I had my shit together. Then asked if I could get you a job. I was like, it's whatever. He can't work at the front because I don't think he's clever. Plus there's a shed in the back where all the Mexicans can live together. <laughs> Hey Dexter, Hindus your dad. Your boy talk a lot is a stupid fat. Your boy snitched on you for moving grams, so you went to his house and started uprooting plants. Talk a lot for you. Yo, that's how I know you faking the funk. How much do you know about yourself if you've never scrapped or taken a punch? You just go to their house and start pulling their trees out like you're breaking a dutch. Cause you face an insane rabbit psycho I can fillet and dice you Dead him and leave the ghost floating right beside you Or I break and cut decks like I'm scratching vinyl Ooh, Fuck boy I can't fuck with you Soon as you walk in, dead I'm cutting your 
stomach up. You want an impossible mission, buddy? I fuck you up. Ain't no fishes in my fish tank. Just seven heads like the governors. Ooh. I'm already champ, and you the runner up with a swole lip and old bitch. Your neck is detached real quick. End up at least clapped with a full clip of the same gun that Canada shot Tetsuo with. Ooh. Hey, and I like your hoes tits. <laughs> <laughs> I'll find her and put more kids inside her than a Chuck E. Cheese. Hold on. Hey. So stop fucking with me, cause you're just an old ass faggot rookie. Fuck all the jokes, you clown ass rapping to me. At the end of the day, I ain't gotta worry about you fighting or clapping toolies, cause you are softer than a rabbit's pussy. You gonna have to shoot me. I fought two people because I felt disrespected. I can't have someone speak on the dead and me not be offended. I'll fight anyone for that shit. And so far, it's been effective. You win some, you lose some, my niggas. But you gotta respect it. Yeah, I lost, but the fact is I looked into the eye of that guy. It's called standing up for yourself. Instead of pulling trees out of someone's driveway, you should try it sometime. Get out! That's a fucking title match. What did this hey, Second Chris. round! Sorry, Chris. <laughs> second round! I'm holding this big ass nigga up. Second, second round! Let's go! Yo, it's time to address the nation. Whoever thinks Hindu rock is dope has seriously lowered their expectations. <laughs> Whoever thinks sex is faking, I'll take your neck and break it. Yo, like the great fallen MC Cannabis said, your thought process is basic. I make a girl scream so much in bed, she gets vocal training. I go through psychotic stages, writing my rhymes behind the papers of missing people's notifications. Here, look, I have to run in my line. <laughs> So if, I, so if I have anger, I know where to place it. This bitch can't control his patience. He's probably right now going through ovulation. I'm colder than Jason, slicing limbs, maybe body modifications. With a name like Hindu Rock, you think you'd be good at breaking? Or play the guitar or be some type of bassist? Um, Yo, this emotional little cunt gave me requests and shit, and he thought because we're down with each other that I'd actually respect him. For example, he told me not to talk about his dead relatives. Well, I could, but I won't. But what the fuck makes you so sensitive? What the fuck do you know about paying for a funeral that's expensive? Now, I don't mean to purposely fuck up our friendship, but didn't LMS once tell you a long time ago that you're nothing but a little bitch living off of your mom's inheritance? Yeah, a catalyst. Now I can see why he partnered up with you to get out of war out of the trenches. But that's none of my business. Well, now it is. Sort of, isn't it? You irrelevant veteran, I'll dictate your life worse than Pinochet. Thousand thought he got away, but you're gonna take his ricochet. Hey, Dex, let's trade our battle together. The fuck this bitch nigga say? <laughs> Who else wanna know something interesting about this dick face? You wanna know why his rebuttals against Medina were so good? Cause they both wrote it together. Now he's that shit gay, and he tried to approach me in the same way. Man, I threw up for the first time in my life when I heard your mixtape. <laughs> Now, now I know we're both down with Ozzy Serum and the new era niggas, but that does not make us counter menace. You're a born loser like someone who spent all their lot of winnings. Yo, it's the finals, there's still no promise of a cash prize. Someone's still doing a lot of sniffing. Yo, to all you pussy promoters, pay your performers instead of sucking the dicks of these New Yorkers. Yeah, that's right, I said it, I ain't got no shame. No shame. There's a little bit of cash because they got somewhat of a name But forget your homies that have been here since the beginning when Auto War first came Now I don't mean no disrespect to PH But I feel like I'm, but I know he's being paid And I feel like I'm being played when my championship battle consists of nothing for me to gain Ooh. Real talk, this fake Kamal Nanjiani getting killed off Ooh. Put him on a permanent vacation like the Griswolds But Ooh. still, I'll give him a chance to redeem himself like I'm Jigsaw I mean, with all the angles and bruises that I brought Don't you think you'll look kind of suspect if the owner of this league made me lose y'all? Mm. You've been setting me up for failure since the beginning, true or not? That's why I've been in your house like 50 fucking times and I ain't never once took my shoes off <laughs> Oh, 
fuck your prefabricated setup, that's not what Bally is, keep it true. Just like I'll admit I'm no good. I live my life Amy Winehousey, fuck the Pedrowsy. But still, it doesn't compare to your two bitch fights that were lousy. That shit reminds me, yo, that shit reminds me of Misha Tate and Ronda Rousey. Don't tell me how to write my rounds, B. This is Horacio Rossi versus Aria Posari. Which is no coincidence, rhymes with so sorry. I'm a word wizard in a cold blizzard, sharper than Oppenheimer and Einstein holding scissors. Am I afraid of the rock? No, mister. I'm on the road like a lizard looking for gold to get richer. Hindu, you're not the god. Steal back your soul and read the scriptures. I mean, I know you're not really Indian or Krishna, but do you at least know about Krishna? No, you don't. Go fuck a figure. Hindu, Hindu rock. Hindu rock. Wait a minute, wait a minute. Hindu, him, Hindu rock. Yo. <laughs> You see how it's subliminally hidden in his name? How he sucks the devil's dick? You fucking derelict. I'm the degenerate that's gonna make you look more stupid than those dances by Ellen DeGeneres. I've traveled inside your mind. There's no sign of intelligence. I'm very good at what I do, not many could do it like me. Hindu, your career is through, so just give up the MIC. Do us all a favor and retire from the ring. And I will promise you I'll stop trying to pretend to act like I can sing. You cannot walk with us or talk with us. I'm Middle Eastern. At least when we blow ourselves up, we're taking a whole block with us. And you about to catch this big L. All that stuttering and stumbling, you can't show the Lord finesse. I hate this bitch. I make kids with lifestyles more poor and dangerous. Yo, you talking to Corleone, the MVP, the most valuable poet on the MIC. I used to fight my pops a lot. I'm the devil's son. Even if you were digging in the crates, you couldn't get your record spun. Ooh. This is how the quest was won. With flaming barrels against enemy arrows, you can tell that you're bum. Just check his apparel. And he's such a clown. Next battle, I bet he's gonna wear a sombrero. But here's, <laughs> yo, but here's a couple things that I need to say though. Remember that whole Stephanie that you went crazy for? I fingered her at New Era Studios in my Mercedes, bro. And as soon as I shoved that finger up her gaping hole, here comes Dex knocking at my window like Captain Sabo. <laughs> never got too smashed, but it's kind of like this belt, because I came to snatch what you thought you had. Ooh! Ooh. Yo, Ooh. yo, this belt is like my dick, because I'm a habit for life. And your bitch is my bitch. Tonight I'm smashing it twice. I don't even need to act too polite, because she give me more neck than Dracula's wife. Ooh. And I'm not talking about the girl today, I'm talking about back then. Way back when, Serum was your only black friend. <laughs> no, you were still suicidal and offbeat. I don't mean to tease, cause talk's cheap, but if you ever need anyone to talk to, you can call LMS. Do not call me. <laughs> about his amazing daughter because he's embarrassed Dex is 35 still slaying that Harry Potter. Oh. Bitch, my arm reach is like Ali's. Not in length, but raw speed. There can only be one champ and you not me. Since we and Kendall, it's fuck A Street. I'll have him retreating to Palm Beach. This shit will go viral in a heartbeat if you cross me. Win or lose, I'm still the same asshole that started the league. I traveled to Florida with all the elites. You are my son an even larger degree because you've only been battling people I gave you without costing a fee since 2003. Oh. And I know it's hard to believe, but I've been on top of the scene since I was a teen. 
the only person that would show up to this cat is Carter D. You steal from others, but at what cost? You bit thousands, Charlotte Webline, about talking to pigs. What are you, the Carlos Mencia rap? Can't come up with your own comedy script? But I could come off the top with my own plot twist, and I know this would surely make Hindu rock piss, but I happen to know for a fact that Sahid and Mark the manager wrote most of your mudslinger battle. Uh -oh. You're the press mafia of Miami. I'm the front friend of the common bottle. You don't know Naga. You don't know how the Earth's first spiritual forces were known as the Naga. You don't know how the Bible of Abraham is really India's Brahma. You don't know how the food and swastika was used by the Nazis for Jewish propaganda. You say you travel all over the world. You're not international. You haven't been to Jerusalem or Uganda. And now that I've been given this assignment to remove this fungus from among us, you will start to see improvement in these functions. If you got a weapons permit, let your guns buzz. Because biters like these got MC dust in their lungs, son. Thanks for giving me a job, cousin. I got 11 of them now. I'm making mad paper and lump sums. And I'm so stoned, I'm also Medusa's husband. Yo, I kick, I kick blows on Axel Rose, get a center for Jimi Hendrix. And now that you wasted your opportunity to defeat me, let me show you how to end this. Yo, this is my homegirl right here, Yadis. This is my girl, Yadis, y'all. Yeah. Okay. And if we ever have a daughter, we're gonna name her Adia. Okay. Oh, right. <laughs> it's so easy to body her. Man, it's so easy to body her. I just be like, body her, body her. <laughs> Yeah, nothing. That's what I thought, you fucking towel head. Yo, fuck a little, fuck a little dot. I'm gonna leave his body all red. Not even the first will be able to fix that head. Oh yeah, a lot of you may not know, but one of my best friends is also his barber. I mean, my crew literally tries to make you look smarter. And me, me and you, Hindu, I mean, we're pretty good friends. I mean, this just keeps getting harder. The truth is, guys, Hindu's a great guy. He's probably even gonna be a great future father. He's a charismatic bartender. You know, he bought some gift baskets off of my mom last December. He drives a hybrid for crying out loud. He's a great society member. I guess what I'm trying to say is, don't fall for who he says he is. You're not a member of ISIS and motherfucker, you're far from a terrorist. I know, I know it's the gloomy truth, but this is like the ending of Titanic and there just ain't enough room for you. So just let go. You're nothing but a brown pen doll from Kendall. You ain't from the ghetto, hell no. My hood has bumped so fucked up, they be walking around talking to their hands thinking they got cell phones. Besides, <laughs> <laughs> yes, shouldn't you be doing technical support for Dell, yo? Instead of shutting out your door for a scene in Miami that seems to never grow because of people like you that steal every penny from my hardworking bones, yeah. giving me opponents that never show, from antics to Jay Woods, 2,000 excuses, and even Buffalo Joe. All these bitches are terrified of my flow. You better fucking give me the gold. Besides, didn't you lose in Colorado? Man, you know damn well it should be drops up here, and not Aziz on sorry on snow. Ooh. It's funny how you always say it up, but I delivered the death blow. You remember, the, you remember when you said I'm dead, bro? Well, to me, that shit ain't a joke. But there's something you gotta know me. I don't give a fuck about bragging rights. So go ahead, bro, give that little fucking belt to Hindu. Cause from the impression I get, it seems like he needs it more than I do. Alright, so how do you feel? How do you feel? Ah, la 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 la! Alright, 
why you can't compare you and I though. I'm the God. You look like you believe the stupid Bible. You rap guns, I actually shoot the rifle. I may look like a suicide bomber, but you are actually suicidal. <laughs> See, while I'm outside fighting for my soul, you on Facebook crying like a hoe. I'm really in the streets firing cigs while you letting your emotions take control. Like a bitch. The thing is, saying you want to commit suicide don't make you deadly. And if you're not looking for attention, my suggestion, just do it already. But all your boys are my boys. And your mom's a nice lady as well. So why don't you take some solace in these relationships and start saving your health. If you a Christian, you know suicide would send you to hell. That's why we can't ever hand you the belt. Because the next day you would use it for hanging yourself. And I'm the Reaper. LinkedIn. And I'm the Reaper. LinkedIn with a bottle of Jack and an ink pen. When we got set up to battle, why didn't you think then? I noticed things about my sick friends. You got a comb over haircut like Woody Harrelson and Kingpin. <laughs> See, if you know Dex, then you know crazy. He has ancestry at Ace, at Ace Street Zapaterias. His abuela was a shoehorn lady. He was the black sheep, and cops had to do more chasing. So all that stress got your head balder than a newborn baby. So, fucking weirdo. Got a face like he licked feet. Fucking vagrant. He ain't bathing in six weeks. If you came here looking for problems, Pipsqueak, you just cannonballed in Shit's Creek. Yo, your shit's weak, so this could end like math and dose. Except instead of a right hand, I brought a pen to jam your throat. But here's one thing that I have to know. Do you think you're actually dope? At first glance, you might think he has that rapid flow. But if you look closer, he's actually having a stroke. Oh, you have to go. And since we've last talked, have you got therapy? I don't know what you're doing, but stop daring me, nigga. You look like a Mexican Ron Jeremy. You're Ron Jeremy. <laughs> And you're not scared. You act crazy on cam because inside there's a little kid screaming for help. That's why you will never win or achieve the belt. Because to beat me, you would have to believe in yourself. Yo. See, I got a razor. It cuts faces and splits bricks. He got a razor. It takes him to the bus station and slits wrists. I'm some emo kid shit. Getting all typed loud online, crying about how the youth don't understand my hip-hop style. I had to console him. I told him. He made the kid quite proud. But in reality, you acting like a bitch right now! Cause if, Cause if the final round is between you and I, dog, you don't need a ticking time bomb to see you won't make it past your suicide watch. Ooh, time, bitch! Position, yeah. But we gotta take it to the judges. We'll be right back. I got shit again. I'm done with my judges. I got shit again. This is one of the craziest fucking title matches I've yeah, ever had crazy. a chance to be a part of. I'm happy. Years in the making, it finally happened. The winner on a two to one decision. Make some noise, y'all. The Art of War Mortal Kombat champion, Hindu Rock. Like, at first it was first, it was one and one. Like, that third, your rebuttal, I'm gonna tell you why you won. That, that suicide bomb rebuttal, that shit was spur of the moment, that shit was clutch. And y'all personal, I was the fingers right the there. Hindu Dex, amazing, amazing fucking performance on both sides. Shit is mine, boy! Yes! But the holding it, but it's mine. Yes! But the official winner of the Mortal Kombat title tournament, Hindu Rock. Thank you, thank you. Finish.